What is going on guys? In this video, we're gonna be talking about how to blow up your biceps, some exercises, and what has worked for me in the last year. What is going on guys? Coach Show here at the Lions Den located in Colmar, PA. Like I said, we're gonna be covering three exercises for your biceps that really helped blow my arms up over the last year. So before we even get into the exercises, the one thing I wanna stress is the importance of doing the arm training before all your main and compound movements for your workout session. So if your arms are your top priority, they need to be prioritized first in your training before you do anything else. And that's gonna make a big difference because you can put a lot more focus into actually activating the muscle and put all your main work effort into that. All right, so let's get right into exercise number one. All right, so the first exercise for biceps that I really enjoy doing are gonna be 21s. Preferably I like to use dumbbells, but you could use a barbell or easy curl bar. Now what you wanna do is do seven reps uh, from the bottom to midway up, and then you're gonna do seven reps from the top to midway down. The last set is gonna be seven, almost completely full range of motion, but we wanna keep that partial still to just keep as much tension on the biceps as possible. In terms of sets and reps, I like doing three sets uh, of the seven, so 21 total reps per set, and I'm a big fan of doing more volume for the biceps than less volume. Okay, so movement number two is gonna be an incline cable curl. Uh, and I really like doing these uh, just because it's gonna be a different variation of a curl, and I like using the rope attachment on the cable because it allows me to do different angles with my wrist. So basically when it comes to arms, you guys are gonna be doing tons and tons of curls. Like that's basically the only exercise you can do uh, for biceps, but what's gonna make the difference is the variation and twist you put on that movement. So for me, adding the incline is a nice variation, plus using the uh, rope attachment is gonna allow me to have a different um, wrist variation to play with, and I really feel like that's gonna hit the bicep a lot. Same thing here, we're doing partial range of motion. I like doing anywhere from 15 to 20 reps for three sets. Last movement to get the blood flow to these biceps is gonna be a preacher curl with an easy bar. Now I don't actually have a preacher curl bench, but I do have two GHD machines, and they work just fine uh, for getting these preacher curls in. Same concepts as before, you guys are probably seeing this trend of shortening the range of motion uh, by not doing full range of motion just because there has been a lot of scientific studies showing that the top uh, three quarters is where we're gonna get most muscle activation when it comes to the biceps. So when I'm doing these, kind of keeping it between that 12 to uh, 15 rep range, three to four sets, and I like having a closer grip, uh, but that's something you can also play with. If you want more of a wider grip or closer grip, just a different variation to the preacher curl that you can do, and something that I have found has really helped increase the size of my biceps. All right, so hopefully you guys took something from this video and you can implement these three exercises into your training regimen to grow your biceps. If you liked the video, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell. Uh, and if you guys are interested in me doing a tricep exercise video, comment down below saying, let's hear it, Coach Joe. So until then, be a lean, mean, strength machine, and I'll catch up with you next time. Peace.